wrote the song. Thoughts become action, tell me what's happening, what's your mind wrapped in, wrapped around. Hey, hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and today, as you can tell by the title and the thumbnail, I have joined the World SMP. So, this is episode one of the World SMP, and it is amazing. And you're probably wondering, where the heck are you? What is this that I'm standing on? So, this is actually the Iron Titan, and I'm very bad at third person and stuff, so I'm just gonna go in first person like normal. And I think it's gonna be turning nighttime, which is not good. So, the World SMP is on an amplified world as you can see which is really really awesome i love it and this is going to open up many many more possibilities for me in building because i really really love building into mountains but i never really had any like any like time to build into mountains because it's really really hard to find like really nice looking mountains in regular default world but now it's amplified so i can i can actually build like a proper base instead of just building regular houses i'll be bare within like bases into the thing but let's let's talk of not talk about building yet because i have no resources so as you can see this is the iron titan it's still kind of work in progress still being built by some of the members i'm not really too sure who's building it but it's still being built and as you can see i already have some food I've been giving some food by the owner of the server which is rain he gave me some food and a golden block, as you can see, a golden block as well. But it is turning nighttime and there's going to be a load of mobs. And um, yeah, but in today's video, as you can tell by the title, and probably by the thumbnail, I will be uh, gathering some material. So I'm going to be gathering some wood, some uh, stone, some maybe iron. I might go mining. I'll probably do that in like a time lapse or so. But first things first, we need to get into or to a tree, and the trees are really hard to get to. And I think Amplified is a hard kind of type of world. I never actually played on an Amplified world, so I'm going to kind of struggle because I'm not good at parkour. Uh, you may know that from like previous videos when I play with uh, piss off games and stuff like that. And by this jump that I couldn't make, and yeah, I'm very terrible and I'm failing already. So the reason I've joined this world SMP is because. The world SMP is a much larger SMP than the SMP I was a part before, so this means that it's going to open up many, many doors for me in the future, you know. And it's a very nice SMP with very, very nice people, which is awesome. It's an unamplified world, and also one thing I forgot to say, it is on the latest snapshot of 1.9. I think it's uh, W16A03, I don't know, I'll put it on the screen if I got it wrong. I'm not too sure about the snapshots. I never actually played on any 1.9 snapshots, so I don't know any of the new blocks. Maybe there's new mobs. I'm not sure. I know there's that mob in the nether where it makes you fly or something like that. The effect that it gives you. And also, by the way, my uh, texture pack is a 1.8 texture pack. So it's not really going to work well with this thing because it's, it's broken a little bit. Okay, let's make a craft note. The crafting tables were at the bottom. So what we're going to do is create some tools uh let me get some tools so let me go down hopefully i'm not gonna die i don't really have a lot of food um i don't really know where everything is i don't know if there's any farms that i can get i did get a little bit of a tour with um or tour given by uh, the owner of the server rain he gave me a little tour around the server but um it was a pretty fast tour because i was pretty busy i was kind of only had like what 20 minutes to get the tour so thank you very much for giving me the tour but I didn't really have the time to do it. So I don't really know a lot of places. And I think there might be a little hole here. Cave that I can. Yes let's get some. Let's get some stone. Because we need some stone tools. We do really need some stone tools. So as I said in today's video. We are going to be gathering a lot of materials. And also before I actually go off and be gathering materials. What I want to say is that. I have changed a little bit of my settings on the OBS, so I've kind of uh, set up better settings for the audio. So hopefully the audio is much better. Hopefully you can't hear as much background noise as you used to hear. Um, hopefully you can't hear as much of my uh, CPU fans. And also I'll be uh, soon, very very soon, I'll be cleaning out my PC out of all the dust. Because yes, oh, there's a creepy. Uh, I don't think it's a good idea to go close to a creepy, but. A couple of days ago, I looked into my PC, and it looks like someone stuffed a lot of dead babies into my graphics card, into my processor, fan, cooling, thing, heatsink, and everywhere, and it's just really, 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 really all, like, dusty. So I'll be cleaning that out, so I'll be doing some maintenance to my PC. So if you don't see maybe any videos or something, that's because I'm doing a lot of maintenance to my PC. I'll be cleaning it out from all the dust, cleaning it all out, changing the thermal paste on my graphics card, so on my GPU, I'll be also getting a new CPU cooler, which means that the videos are going to be 
are oh, gonna have less background noise which is really really awesome and by the way without you guys I wouldn't be able to afford these things like these CPU new CPU cooler so thank you very much especially to our Patreons for actually supporting me and if you do want to become a Patreon there's normally an annotation on the screen and a little eye contact card whatever they're called uh, where you can go and become a Patreon. There's certain really awesome rewards which, uh, which you can receive for becoming a Patreon. And also you get to play on the same server as me and get a shout out in my video. So that's really, really awesome. But um, yeah, that's all I kind of needed, all of these little resources. So I'm going to go and gather some wood. I'll probably do um, some things as like get some food. Yeah, getting food, that's going to be the main thing. So I'm going to get more stone. I'm going to get more things. I'll probably do that in jump cart, get myself go to the spawn town and maybe get some food I've got a golden block which I could probably buy some food from someone's shop and by the way we have there is like a um, shopping mall in the uh, what's it called oh there we go taking some damage shopping mall in the nether so I can actually go and maybe buy some food so there's no shops actually in like the regular kind of world the reason for that is because it's amplified it's pretty hard to get like a nice flat mall and stuff and whatever they're called I don't know shopping centers that's right uh, like a nice looking shopping center so I'll go there get some uh, food probably because I only got eight potatoes and there is a creepy uh, is he coming for me oh no um oh no wait there I forgot you have to like there's a new combat system I can't just spam click it doesn't work I like the animations though they're pretty awesome oh you can't block with a sword anymore Oh, that was so close. Okay, I'm not going to mess around with any mobs because I've got one level, no armor, no nothing. I think it's time to go to the portal. And where is the portal? It's over here. All right, so I'm going to go to the shopping mall, get some food, and I'll be right back with you guys. All right, guys, so I'm about to approach the main nether hub. So as you can see, the nether hub looks amazing. These guys on the server, they're really, really creative. They have an amazing nether, and... Uh, this is actually the nether, and the shopping mall, I think it's on top of the nether, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, everyone has their own tunnels. I love this nether hub. It's amazing. It's got these light designs with the banner. Is the, are these banners? I think these banners, right? I think, yeah. Or little flag things on the on the glow screen. That is really, really awesome. So, what I'm going to do is go to the shopping mall, which I think, if I remember correctly, is on top of the this here. Is this the shopping mall? Yes, this is the shopping mall. So, I think I'm going to have to buy some uh, food, because I'm really, really low on food. And also, there's some type of a bank where you can uh, exchange uh, golden blocks for iron, I mean, uh, golden blocks for diamonds. So, I think one golden block, like a thing, exchange unit thing. I don't know what it's called, but it's something like that. It's pretty awesome. But first things first, I'm going to actually find a food place where I can actually buy some food, and I'll be right back with you guys. Alright guys, so I finally found a nice shop which actually sells bread and some coffee, what's this, coffee. Okay, speed 2 coffee, I'm not actually going to spend anything on here or for the coffee, but I'm actually going to get some sandwiches because every single shop I, sh I saw and if there's food in it, it's super expensive, it's literally super expensive, this place you really need to be rich to actually shop in this mall, it's like a rich people's place, but... This is one diamond per third, or got or one or gold block per thirty-two. So I'm actually going to take thirty-two bread and give one golden block. So there we go, golden block. Here we go. So we got rid of one of our golden blocks for a sandwich or bread or whatever you want to call it. Some they they actually renamed it to a sandwich, which is pretty really awesome. But um, I'm going to keep that for later. First, I'm going to eat my jacket potatoes. But um, I've got my food, so now it's going to be time to do a little bit of a time lapse. So I'll show you where to go to the main uh, place, which I, if I remember, I think it's here. This is where you go to the spawn town where everyone actually built. And I've got an egg. Let's see if we can get a chicken arm. No, we can't get a chicken arm. Okay, by the way, this is the bank area where you can exchange. If you put, I think, yes, a golden block in this chest... Uh, what happens is that you get a golden block uh, or a diamond here, I think, and then if you put a golden block uh, here, you get a diamond block here or something like that. It goes like really weird because one diamond is equal to one um, one uh, golden block. So um, that's it's pretty cool. I love. Probably there's like tons of redstone behind. Oh, we can see a little bit. Oh my god, this is too complicated for me. I'm not even gonna look into there. But I think this portal takes us to the main 
town, you know, the spawn town, the world SP spawn town where we can build their own houses and stuff. So let's have a look. Oh my god. Oh, that is so loud. The portals are so loud. And yes, this is it. So over here, as you can see, there's a bit of an enchanting area. This is just just for it to look nice. That's what Rain told me. It's very nice. A little conference room, I would say. And this is a to-do list kind of thing. Project. Project board. Okay. There's no ideas on the board yet. I'll probably come up with some ideas in the future. But here is the spawn town. And I'm sorry if I'm getting a bit of lag spikes. But I am loading tons and tons of chunks. Which have tons and tons of blocks because of the amplified world. I had to turn down some of my... Um, certain uh, options for it to work but this place looks amazing I've explored it a little bit already I might do a bit of a like a time-lapse montage maybe in the future videos of exploring the whole world or something like that or actually doing like a tour world when I learn this thing or with someone maybe Porter because Porter's actually part of this SMP but uh, now it's going to be time for me to find a little spot for myself so I can settle down place all my chest which I may have or create very soon and this place looks awesome and it's all filled with awesome ideas and I think a lot of people has taken up a lot of space um, I, I miss my optifine yes um, hopefully 1.9 is gonna come out really really soon because the snapshots they have no optifine the texture packs glitch and I can't use the other texture pack which I use so I'm using the regular faithful texture pack so the links in the description will change a little bit for a couple of videos until the 1.9 releases but this area looks nice I love it it's great it's it's awesome it's awesome so I'm gonna go explore this area try finding a little spot for myself and I'll be right back with you guys so guys after me looking around the whole spawn town and everything else all most of the spots all the, like the nice looking spots have been taken up but these awesome gigantic builds and I'm really upset that I can't zoom in with Optifine come on Mojang release 1.9 quick so I can have Optifine so I can zoom in I really miss this feature but I really need to eat and there is some wheat which I might borrow I will replant it I'm sorry whoever house this is but I'm gonna steal a little bit of your wheat at the beginning hopefully you don't mind but um What's going to happen is that this is an area which I found which I think would be nice to build. I think like our start point, you know, have our chest here. Just claim this side of the mountain. So over here I'll probably land terraform this area. I don't want to get too close to this build or any other builds because I don't want to interfere with anybody's space. Maybe they have some type of plan which I... I might interfere with so I don't want to be too close to people's bases but there's so little amount of space where I can build where it's like nice looking area in this spawn town so um this is like a nice hill kind of based area I'll probably build like a nice house sticking out from the whole shebang thing it's just gonna be like a nice small thing with a storage area a room maybe some kind of other rooms and then afterwards we'll probably move out somewhere to build a nice base but I'm moving around a lot I don't really have a lot of food so first things first i'm gonna get myself settled so i don't really know where the crafting thing is over here i, I mean i do roughly it does highlight it but my texture pack is kind of broken in this version of minecraft so let's place this down make a chest and also make a sign with that saying that i've claimed this area so i'm gonna make a chest make a sign saying i have claimed this area i'm gonna have to get some wood which i'll probably do this in the time lapse so where can i make this sign thing let me do this and boom, boom, and place a sign on here. There we go. And boom, let's write. So, and hillside kind by, and then my name. Oh, we shouldn't do, there we go. And then my name, and avoid. There we go. Oh, let's just do this and then let's do a smiley face. There we go. Done. So I've claimed this little area, this whole hill sign. Hopefully I can come up with really, really nice ideas. I already have some ideas which I have come up with and they're really, really nice actually. But I can't really tell you guys because I'll spoil all the series and stuff. I've got a list of them. But um, all I can say, everything's going to look really, really, really nice and smexy delicious. But now... 
because I cleaned this, I'm going to get some torches and stuff like that. So I'm going to put all my stuff that I really don't need to have on me. I'm going to get some um, wheat from there right now. But um, I'm going to go get some wheat, get myself prepared. And I'll do a bit of like a mining slash item gathering cha um, challenge thing. So if you want to comment down below on how many resources I'll get. Um, I'm going to go and collect some wood, some iron, maybe some gold. Because you know gold is like a currency here. Because the iron titan very soon. So they, I think they, they had iron as a currency, but not anymore. Um, but um, yeah, soon there's gonna be an iron time. I'll be able to get some iron tools really, really fast. But first things first, I'm actually gonna have to gather some iron myself before the iron titan comes up and starts working. Um, yeah, guys, I'm gonna go get all of these wheats, uh, replant them, go and do the time lapse, and I'll be right back with you guys. What is this dirty moonshine of which you speak? <laughs>
Alright guys, so after me doing the whole mining and gathering resources thing, um, it was a great, it was a great adventure. I've actually went through parts which people already discovered just because I didn't really want to die with all this equipment, you know, I found some iron, I found some precious materials and some materials which will help me start off and I didn't really want them to go and I am using this new 1.9 feature which I can use a second hand to eat and I have to switch slots to actually get my food or torches and stuff which is really really amazing it is a bit buggy time to time when you were trying to place blocks but you start eating or you start placing uh, torches instead of you know what I mean but it's awesome it is amazing I like this new feature it's great but um now it's time to reveal how many resources I got from the time lapse or the mining challenge. So this is, this was a little bit of a mining challenge. It was a bit of a different mining challenge because I was collecting some other stuff too. But um, the resources I'm gonna ask you guys to guess for is how many diamonds, how many gold, how many um, iron, how many lapis, how many stuff like that where you normally go mining. How much stuff did I get? None of that cobblestone, none of that stuff. Only the like the precious materials. So how many of those I got. So if you want to go in the comment section right now and just quickly jot a quickly guess and do like your guess or rewatch the time lapse and try to count out all of the resources which might be a little bit hard but um it's possible. It is possible. But alright so are we ready? Are we ready to count out all the resources or to show and reveal all the resources? All right, ready? Three, two, one, doom. All right, so we got one stack and 51 coal. Coal is the main ore, like, which I kept on finding. And also, it's so hard to mine with uh, stone pickaxes. So at the end, I just, when I got the iron pickaxe, when I found uh, the six diamonds, you know, with the diamonds, I thought, you know what, I'll just get an iron pickaxe and carry on with the iron pickaxe. There's no point in creating stone tools. So we got 64 and 51 coal, uh, we got 53 iron ore which is amazing, we can probably gear ourselves up and also we got a helmet from a skeleton which is awesome and two arrows so some protection already, enchanted helmet, it doesn't have good durability but it can do it for now before we actually get anything. We also got six diamonds like I said, really awesome, six diamonds, <sighs> it's bad that I didn't have any fortune and stuff like that, that would be awesome if I did, then I'll be able to, you know, um, get more than six diamonds probably like 12 or something but you know we gotta work with what we have at the moment also I found 12 lapis which are going to be useful in the enchanting even though there are some like community lapis uh, next to the enchanting table and stuff so we got 11 levels I'm gonna be trying to save up the levels try not to die on the server that's my main point because on the last SMP server I actually got my first death by being killed by a, the gaming Jess but um yeah, that's just before I made my first video, which was really, really upsetting. But um, I'm going to try to keep my zero, uh, death count to zero. We don't really have a death count on the, um, where you press tab on the, um, whatever this is called, where you see your names and stuff. Uh, we don't really have a death count. But um, before I end this video, I just want to talk about the plans that I've got on this server, on this SMP server. This new SMP server called the World SMP. So... What I'm going to be trying to do as my goals is that I'm going to be building massive projects. So, what I mean by that, instead of building just like a regular house like I used to always do in every survival let's play, I'm actually going to build into a mountain, build a like a really, really nice, cool looking structure, build inside a mountain, maybe start doing some redstone, start doing some actually better redstone, better redstone than I currently kind of done for the past existence of my channel and the past existence of me being thing and look at this I can dance da -da 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 -da. it's pretty awesome <laughs> a little glitch that happens if you're like full and stuff it's pretty awesome you can dance but um yeah um that's what I'm gonna be aiming for is to build really really awesome structures that you guys are gonna like and also I was thinking should I move the patreon temple into the world SP should I rewrite every bot every single patreon on the world smp should i create like a temple and tell me what type of temple you want you want an underwater temple maybe a jungle temple maybe something in the air maybe underground temple something like that or maybe in the lava temple or maybe even in the end we're not sure but um we actually do have the end i think they already fought the ender dragon and i think there is an ender pearl farm on this world smp so that's gonna be awesome that's gonna be really really helpful i'm not sure where the end portal is so i'm gonna have to find that out 
for the next episode. But um, that's going to be it for today. Um, this is all my future plans. Hopefully, you're going to enjoy this day on the world s and I, I am. I had a really nice, warm welcome on Twitter, on all the social media sites, on the group chat, on like the TeamSpeak Discord and stuff like that. So, really, really awesome. Thank you very, very much for inviting me to the world SMP. I love this server. I've got a lot of nice future plans planned for this server and the whole series. But that's going to be it for today. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to leave a like. If you really, really loved it, please make sure to subscribe. But um, yeah, thank you very, very much for watching. Take care, everybody, and bye bye.